day everyone do you know how much files such as image music or videos is stored in your computer then this is the time to know and learn how to calculate your data storage how data storage works Data storage is a recording of information in storage medium, thumb drive, magnetic tape, optical disk, and hard disk are some examples of recording media. Recording is accomplished by virtually any form of energy. Electronic data storage requires electrical power to store and retrieve data. Computer data storage is one of the core functions of a general purpose computer. Electronic documents can be stored in much less space than paper documents. But, do you know how data is being measured? If you're familiar with the units of measurement in computer memory, can you tell me the abbreviation meaning of the following? B. Correct. It's a byte. KB. Very good. It's kilobyte. MB. Yes, it's megabyte. GB. Correct. It's a gigabyte. TB. Very good. It's a terabyte. How about PB? It's petabyte. EB. Hmm. It's exabyte. Well, do you know where petabyte and exabyte are commonly used? According to Wikipedia, as of January 2013, Facebook users had uploaded over 240 billion photos with 350 million new photos every day. For each uploaded photo, Facebook generates and stores 4 images of different sizes, which translated to a total of 960 billion images and an estimated 357 petabytes of storage. In 2013, Randall Munro, an American cartoonist, compiled published assertions about Google's data centers and estimated that the company has about 10 exabytes stored on disk and additionally approximately 5 exabytes on tape backup. Anyway, do you know what is the highest storage capacity of a hard disk drive so far? As reported by Anantech, Seagate has confirmed it plans to ship an 18TB hard drive in the first half of year 2020, followed by a 20TB drive in the second half of the year. While a bit is the smallest representation of data, the most basic unit of digital storage is the byte. Now, let's take a look if you still know. What is bit? What is a byte? Bit is an abbreviation of binary digit that represents the smallest piece of data. A bit can have only two possible values, either one or zero digit. However, a byte is a unit of data that has 8 binary digits long. A byte is the unit most computers use to represent a character. When you produce 8 combination of bits, it's called a byte. The number of bits we have determine how much information we can store. It simply means that if a single letter has a value of 8 bits, it is equivalent to 1 byte. So, if you type a short story, with a thousand words, this will require thousands of bytes. When referring to storage space, we use the terms bytes, kilobytes, megabytes, 
gigabytes and terabytes. A kilobyte is equal to 1024 bytes. A small email could be considered around 2 kilobytes and a 3-page paper around 25 kilobytes. Moreover, a 1 megabyte is equal to 1 million of bytes. For normal quality audio, a song is about 3 to 4 MB. Meanwhile, a high quality photo may be about 2 to 5 MB. Then, 1 gigabyte is equal to over 1 billion of bytes. A computer may have up to 4 GB of RAM. A single layer DVD can hold up to 4.7 GB of data. A hard drive could be used to hold 750 GB. But the most exciting is 1 terabyte. It consists of over 1 trillion of bytes. External hard drives may commonly be found at around 1 to 8 terabyte. Once we know the size of a file or folder, it is possible to determine the number of bytes being used. Let's take a look at the sample question. How many 20 kb of document files can be stored in a 1 MB folder? We're going to convert the 20 kb to bytes. If 1 kb is equal to 1024 bytes, then you're going to multiply it to 20. The answer will be 20,480 bytes. Then, if 1 MB is equal to 1 million, 48,576 bytes, we're going to divide it to 20,480 bytes. The answer will be 51.2. It simply means that there is 51 files can be stored in a 1 MB folder. Now, it's your turn to engage on what you've learned. Look at this problem. How many 1.25 GB of video can be stored in a 1 terabyte of external drive? For a simple solution, remember the conversion table. Since 1 terabyte is equal to 1024 gigabyte, 1024 gigabyte Will be divided into 1.25 gigabyte. So far, there are 820 files of MP4 videos can be stored in external hard drive. Please remember that before you divide the two given numbers, they should be both the same unit. If not, you have to use the conversion table first to convert its unit. I know you are very much excited to calculate the data storage. You can answer the exercises on a piece of paper. Then once it's done, show it with your solution. For the first exercises, how many 4.3 MB of songs can be stored in a 16 GB of flash drive? Secondly, how many 3.7 MB of video files can be stored in an 800 MB of CD? For a better experience, let us do it practically. Can you make full your pencil case with all your ball pens and pencils? After that, kindly count them all. How many pencils or ball pens can be stored in your pencil case? Write it on a piece of paper. Same as like a pot. How much soil can be stored in your pot? 
another, you can also try this. How many pieces of marbles or stones can be stored in your container? Hey! Did you learn something new you didn't know before? Please share with us! Do you think this lesson is useful in your day-to-day -day living experiences? Then, let us proceed on what you can do. Showing the storage devices, kindly arrange them from high to the highest storage capacity. Please write down on your notebook. There are also sets of problems indicated below. Please solve it on your notebook and show your solution. Alright, that's all for today. I hope you've learned a lot. Goodbye class!